Hey Antiques Roadshow friends, I'm Amy Burkett here in the studio at PBS Charlotte and we know how much you love Antiques Roadshow so we have partnered with our friends at Everything But The House Auction Service. Jackie Denny is a co-founder and owner joining us today that we are going to have our own version of Antiques Roadshow right here in Charlotte at our studios coming up on September 16th. It's all about supporting the quality and commercial free programming here at PBS Charlotte. Your donation of $120 gets you the opportunity to bring two treasures to have your professional evaluators give them a verbal evaluation. Talk to us a little bit about what type of goodies we should bring. Well, there's a lot of things you can bring. You can bring things in the decorative arts category. You can bring pottery, porcelain, art, jewelry, old books, um, paper, which is ephemera type things, old photographs, documents, things you've been wondering about. Is it an heirloom or is this a piece that I should let go to another collector to love? So many good things. Like I said, that $120 donation, you can secure it on your Visa, MasterCard, Discover, or American Express, or if you would like to become what we call an ongoing supporter of your public television station right here in Charlotte, you can do $10 a month as an ongoing donation. Again, that'll get you two items, but maybe you've got a whole bunch of stuff you want to bring. So we've got another opportunity. Three items at that $156 level, that's $13 a month as an ongoing donation to support quality commercial free programs like, of course, Antiques Roadshow that you love. Talk to us a little more. You guys started, this is your 10th anniversary year. It is our 10th anniversary year. We took our service online in 2007 and that was to accommodate maximizing things for families. You know, sometimes it's really difficult to give up an heirloom, but there are many families that are in transition or there's a health concern in the family and so we wanted it to go to the highest buyer that was going to love that a second time for that person. And you're in 27 cities across 22 states? That's correct. 900 employees? Absolutely. It's a growing business for us. And it's so exciting because we know how much you love Antiques Roadshow. And so we decided to create something that we're calling Carolina Collectibles. You have a ton of goodies and treasures at your house. We want to invite you down to our PBS Charlotte location so that you can see how much those goodies are actually worth. And you've brought some goodies with you today. Give us some comparisons. So let's talk about these two porcelain plates. These are called oyster plates. And in Victorian times, Victorians had a plate for everything. They had a plate for fish, they had a plate for oysters, dessert, for berries. And it was a sign that we had arrived and, and things are really good for us now. But two plates which look similar can be deceivingly different when it comes to value. This lovely little plate here, very decorative, love the colors. You know, fair market, maybe $75 to $125. Now that's the white one. That's this little one. Over here, we have this beautifully done plate. And the thing that distinguishes this oyster plate from any other is this was the service pattern from Rutherford B. Hayes, presidential pattern. And so this has already sold at auction before another form like this for $4,100. So two plates that look similar, and when you look at your china cabinet, you may be looking at two plates that are very similar in style, but very different in value. And if you've had the argument at Thanksgiving the last five years, it's time to bring it in and find out who's right. Now, you know, we often uh, share the conversation here at PBS Charlotte that our station, our logo, what we talk about a lot is that you can channel your curiosity on PBS Charlotte. Now, I bet you have a whole lot of curiosity about what's in grandma's attic and how much Absolutely. it's worth. Because everyone has enjoyed watching Antiques Roadshow and saying, oh my gosh, I had no idea. And you love their faces light up. So when you come here to PBS Charlotte, our studios located at 3242 Commonwealth Avenue in Charlotte, we're gonna have our TV crews here too. And we hope that we're gonna find some really great aha opportunities that might be from your attic or your basement or your dusty old garage. And we may even be able to turn it into a television show in the future. It all depends what kind of good goodies we have. So be aware that it's going to be a really fun, exciting yes. day. We didn't mention from 9 till 5. It's September 16th. That's a Saturday, of course. And you are responsible for getting your items here and getting them back home. So that's something that's really important for people to understand. What do you think are some of the things that have kept people from finding out what their items are worth in the past? 
just not a source that, that makes sense for them. People are kind of timid. You know, they, there's an antique shop on the corner. Maybe I'll go down there and ask him, but oh no, I'm gonna be disrupting his work day. And so now I'll just leave it there again. So it sits there time after time. And then maybe the story that was originally told about it builds. I remember a blue and white plate in my mom's china closet who she swore she was gonna retire on, kept telling her it was a $9 plate. It was a lovely plate. She finally took it to someone else besides me, even though I'm in the business, oh, dear. and was offered $10. And she came home and put it up there and she said, but it's worth a million to me. So it's always the story that helps us get us there, but this gives you a transparent, open process that you can come in. We're gonna be fun and it's gonna be exciting to figure out what your item is. So go out to lunch with a friend, both bring an item and share stories and remember the day with us. And you know what, that's what PBS Charlotte is all about. It's all about making memories, it's all about sharing stories, it's all about channeling your curiosity to support your community. And that's really what we're asking for right now, is your financial support to keep quality commercial free programs on the air for yet another year. But this time we decided to do something a little different and our way of saying thank you is a unique opportunity and an experience that I think people will remember for many, many years. While Jackie will be joining us on September 16th, you're gonna bring some extra friends for help, right? Yes, absolutely. I'm gonna have six or seven from my company here. We're all specialists in different areas, everywhere from jewelry to art to fine porcelains to textiles. If you have an interesting uh, rug or maybe an interesting um, coverlet on a bed, an afghan on a bed, and you've always been curious about its origin, we'll be able to tell you the story of how that item came into being and then what we call fair market value, what somebody really would pay for this item to take it and love it from you. What kind of exciting stories do you have of the biggest surprises that you've seen? Well, recently we were doing a very full home in Cincinnati and at the bottom of a room that we didn't even know was there until we'd uncovered the room was a Torah crown. And this is specific to the Judaica community. Um, it ended up selling for $45,000. But at the bottom of a room where linens were piled on top and, and floral items were piled on top in an old suitcase had been brought over in the late 1800s by somebody's grandparents and then stuck away and forgotten about. So it was a very fun surprise for that family. How many surprises, fun surprises, do you have at your house? I bet you have a ton, whether it's a Mickey Mouse collector's item or an old, another old toy when you were a child that you just couldn't part with. Now you might wanna find out just how much it's worth. We're gonna have a verbal valuation uh, on this day. It's September 16th, it's a Saturday. It's right here in Charlotte at PBS Charlotte. We are right off of 74 at Briar Creek. It's 3242 Commonwealth, but don't worry, we will mail you all the information information. Please call the number on the bottom of your screen right now. And you have a couple of ways you can secure your items to be evaluated with a Visa, MasterCard Discover, or American Express. Or you can choose to be an ongoing supporter. Now, this is not just a payment plan. This is someone who believes in quality programming, believes in supporting their community, and wants to be a part of us and will hopefully support us for many years to come, but might want to get in at that $10 a month opportunity. $10 a month, $120 in a year gives you the opportunity to bring two items. But if you want to go for $13 a month, $156 in a year, we're going to have you bring three items to our wonderful good friends in this new partnership that we have here at PBS Charlotte with Everything But The House auction offerings. And we're excited to talk about new things. We're going to head back to another part of Antiques Roadshow in just a moment. We know how much you love it, but please don't put it off. This is what, like you said, People dust things under the under the rug. Your mom thought about it for many, many years. She sure did. Just knew that it was something valuable. Some days we get disappointed, but there's so many stories and so many memories that come out of it. And this is gonna be a real community day as yes. we share with each other oh, the yes. highs and maybe the lows and, and so much fun. So it's a great event and we're so grateful for everything but the house and the amazing talent that they bring for being able to appraise your 
wonderful collectibles. It's called Carolina Collectibles, and it's coming up on September 16th. All the information can be given to you from our operators waiting to hear from you right now, or you can go online to pbscharlotte.org and click on the donate button and look for the thank you gift, and this is our way of saying thank you, your opportunity to bring some goodies for our Carolina Collectibles Day on September 16th. There's more to share, don't go anywhere, but enjoy Antiques Roadshow right now, my friends. We hope to see you on September 16th.